The Gleaner visited the Edith Dalton James Comprehensive High School in Dehaney Park, St Andrew. The school is in mourning after it lost one of its students, 15-year-old Ian Palmer Jr., who died in a house fire that took the lives of four others of his family members on Saturday, January 28. His classmates laid a classroom tribute to him at his desk during a mourning vigil held in his memory. Very calm and very respectful most times. And consequently, many persons do not know of him because he's always just, as I said, quiet, seen but not heard. And when he's seen or heard, most times he's doing something positive. So it's quite unfortunate that his demise would have come that way, very untimely. And this morning, the guidance counselor, Miss Thomas, gave a special word. And, and for the first session of the day, his class never actually had formal teaching, but we had grief counseling. Hardworking, honest. honest, nice, someone to talk to, someone to trust and a host of other positive statements. There was not one negative statement. A real friend, somebody you could confide in, were some of the comments, which was um, the most, most touching. Because um, they were asked to just share, you know, since he's not here and you couldn't say this to him, um, what would you want to say? So students, there was an outpour of what they felt. Um, about him and his personality. It was just an outpour of love and admiration. And I said to myself, this young man was in this class as a positive role model because that not one person stood up to say that his behavior was in, in, negatively impacted on theirs. All um, gave positive affirmations about his behavior.